Hey tech freaks from across the world. Welcome to my channel Tech Store. Before starting to watch this video, hit that subscribe button and also hit the bell icon. Do not forget to like, share and comment our videos. Thank you so much guys. Hey guys, I'm Anand, your tech guide from Tech Store and we have with us the Lenovo Legion 5 Pro 2022 edition hands on with us today and in this video we're going to be showing you the procedure to basically disassemble, rip apart the base of this particular laptop, also a review of the entire laptop and uh, for you to buy or not to buy this particular Lenovo Legion 5 Pro, this is a must watch video. So let's do it. We have the white variant of the Lenovo Legion 5 Pro and the one that we are covering is a Core i7 11th generation with a 8GB RTX 3060 and 16GB with 1TB SSD model. So over here as soon as you see the top is having this beautiful Legion logo over here. It is glowing, uh, blue color uh, glow is there on this particular logo and uh, it's got this smooth matte finish. It is totally polycarbonate, no metal whatsoever. Then there is this dual tone over here, grey and white, so it looks uh, pretty neat and cool. Once you open, you have uh, three-sided nano bezel, fantastic nano bezel and the screen quality is simply amazing. It's got 500 nits, 100% sRGB and it has uh, Quad HD, that is 2K resolution screen on this particular screen. The screen is like nothing I have seen in the gaming laptops at this point of time, at this price point. Absolutely fantastic and uh, breathtaking screen over here. The keyboard again is white in color. The, the touchpad area also has got this uh, matte finish over here inside and uh, the same white color continues and uh, the keyboard is a uh, backlit so it does not have a RGB backlit it's got a blue color backlit which you will be seeing here the keyboard quality has always been uh, the best in the Lenovo Legion series of laptops and uh, there's absolutely no stutter whatsoever when you press the keys uh, they're real rock solid uh, feel that you get when you are uh, working on the keyboard is simply nothing uh, comparable to any other laptop in this category. So it has got a Core i7 11th generation with RTX uh, 3060. Uh, although there is a 3070 variant also which is a little costlier but there is not much difference in terms of the performance. So I would suggest you can go in with the RTX 3060. So coming to the ports here, uh, on the left side you have this uh, huge uh, heat uh, dissipation area. You have a C type port which is also a full charging port and you have a headphone mic combi again uh, the speaker grill is over here on the left in the front uh, again there is absolutely no IO on the right you have a webcam shutter and uh, you have a USB 3.0 full port and then you have a heat sink uh, dissipation area and the rear is simply fantastic you can see two full uh, vents for dissipating the heat and you have an ethernet port full gigabit ethernet port another C, uh, C type port over here two more USB 3.0 ports, HDMI port, you have another USB 3.0 port and a charging pin connector. So this is the way the rear of the Lenovo Legion 5 Pro looks. The Lenovo logo looks uh, fantastic over here. The base, uh, as you can see, is also quite clutter free. There are some screws that are visible, uh, which we will show you in the latter stage, uh, how to get into this particular base and upgrade the laptop. And uh, the rudders are also quite uh, thick and heavy for you to give that layer when you're working. The speaker grill is over here so it's got down firing speakers and uh, the vent area also is quite good for the inlet of fresh air from this particular vent. So this is a video shot taken from the web camera of the Lenovo Legion 5 Pro and as you can see the video quality is very good even the audio quality is fantastic. So good job on the camera here uh, by Lenovo. Let's take the audio quality of this Lenovo Legion 5 Pro. The audio quality is quite good. Uh, we could see a dB rating of around 70 plus on this particular uh, laptop on the audio meter and uh, it's not very uh, tinny basically it has got good bass but uh, Lenovo would have good done better actually it is not as loud as we had expected the speakers to be so an average uh, above average speaker on the Lenovo Legion 5 Pro 
So let's have a look at uh, whether uh, the hinge stability test it gets passed through and it opens through with one hand. Obviously, it has to because it's such a heavy laptop. It will. So as you can see, it opens with a one hand operation very comfortably. So it passes in the hinge stability test. This is the max that it will tilt to, nothing beyond this. Don't try to open it beyond this, it might just break off. So good sturdy hinges over here by Lenovo. So this is the adapter that comes along with the Legion 5 Pro and it is a 300 watt adapter because the TDP of the graphic card is around 140 watts. So you need to have a 300 watt adapter and this is pretty huge if you would ask me. You might just get killed if this is taken to hit somebody out. So it's that huge if you would ask me. And it's got a USB type uh, connector. First thing first, we need to flip the laptop and we need to remove all the screws that are visible here. All the four screws are of the same length, so you can keep them at one side. These four screws here are of a smaller length, as you can see over here. Keep them on the one side to avoid any confusion. Now take a prior like this and uh, start protruding from one of the sides here from this side over here and the base cover will be off this is the inners of the Lenovo Legion 5 Pro now this is the battery uh, this over here is the RAM bay area this is the M.2 SSD area Wi-Fi chip is beside this so let's start with the battery first if you want to replace the battery you need to come all the way up to here and remove these screws so we need to remove this uh, heat sink of the SSD to access the battery screw here actually comes off and uh, you need to remove this screw of the SSD after which you'll get access to this all right so if you want to replace the battery just pull this out over here and the just pull this thing out the connector and it will be out so this is the battery that uh, Lenovo installs uh, inside the Lenovo Legion 5 Pro it's a uh, it typical capacity is 5210 mAh and 80 watt hours and the power rating is 15.36 volt so this is the battery that you need to replace the type code is uh, L20D4PC1 so this is the same battery if you want to replace you need to buy and install it into your Lenovo Legion 5 Pro so coming to the part where the SSD is put this particular screw so there are two SSD bays here, one is over here, another one is over here. We'll remove this one also. As you can see, this uh, SSD slot is uh, empty right now. They have given a screw as well. So you can take another M.2 2280 NVMe Gen X4 SSD and you can install it uh, very, very comfortably by just inserting the SSD like this. You need to remove the screw that is there over here and the SSD fits absolutely fine. This is a CMOS cell over here. If you want to replace the CMOS cell, say your uh, laptop from three, four years of usage, you're having date and time sync issue, just need to remove this and put another CMOS cell and again put it back. So the RAM is over here, so we need to just take a minus pin over here like this. Remove the covering and uh, the RAM bays are exposed here. It's got two RAM DIMM slots, so the total RAM capacity you can upgrade up to is 32 GB. By default it comes with 8 plus 8, uh, 16 GB. For dual data rate you need to have both the RAMs with the same frequency for it to give you the optimal performance. and. Uh, this is the way it is. So if you want to say remove this particular RAM and install another RAM, just use your two thumb fingers and uh, remove the notch here. The RAM that you need to buy is a DDR4 3200 MHz uh, laptop RAM, sodium RAM. It might be a 8 GB, 16 GB or a 4 GB also in a scenario you want to upgrade another 4 GB only. So this is what you need to buy if you want to install. Now just take this uh, RAM and again install it like this very very comfortably in a scenario your ram has gone bad and you want to replace it also this is the way it works let's put the lid back this is the wi-fi chip this is the processor fan two dual fans over here in another video we'll show you uh, entirely how to remove this heat sink assembly and apply thermal paste in one of our other videos which is of a earlier legion 5 uh, 
uh, laptop we have completely removed and cleaned the entire thing you can refer that video and you can do the same process actually there is no major difference in the legion series whatsoever from the past two years so these are the speakers over here one and two speakers they don't have a hard drive bay over here given because the battery size is quite huge so they have not accommodated the hard disk uh, connector so let's just fit everything back let's put the battery back By default, it comes uh, along with a 1 terabyte Gen 4 SSD. You can take a similar Gen 4 M.2 SSD and you can install it. Alright, so let's put the base cover back. Put it like this, from this side, from the top. So this my friends is a video showing you the Lenovo Legion 5 Pro series of gaming laptops by Lenovo. Absolutely fantastic laptop. But for the speaker, everything else is uh, simply a cut above. For the given price range of around 1.6 here in India, you are getting the best that you can get uh, in its class. The Quad HD screen is a treat to anybody who is into content creation or into YouTubing or photography or videography or gaming. It is an absolute treat to have this screen at your disposal. The keyboard quality and the number of ports that it has the battery quality also is good the battery is giving you around a backup of around one and a half to two hours for continuous gaming and on normal average uses around four hours is what it is giving and uh, so we've shown you how to replace upgrade the different components that are available in the base of this particular laptop hope you liked the video guys uh, do let us know your suggestions and comments and do not forget to subscribe to us remember we take a lot of pain to produce these videos and we require you to subscribe and hit that bell icon thank you so much